kani shadi prosom kadei tang ka cover up jong ka government ya ka failure jong ka 67% of the population depend on agriculture for livelihood tourism le shakan dong ka dan ngam ko aban pelong political namar ngam dei politician den rei nga syukran be tang mentai position de jong ba yang hi ki festival ki dei So, so yes, I think I think festivals are essential, but there has to be way to has to be a way for us to understand how is it benefiting us and who the people are going to tell us is benefiting us. So, what are the uh, what are the parameters that we use to to understand whether it's benefiting us in the long term or not? Yeah, but so to go away, do. But the Malay government has been pulled to pass a law that commercial festival can benefit. You know, manu when you anong can you anong the government. Are we losing out on the real meaning of, you know, celebrating this particular tree that the that, that Shillong is famous for? Are we keeping track of the number of trees that are there in the state? Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, our esteemed panelists, and of course, my dear students. And I welcome you to this edition of the campus talk. Jointly organized by the Tourism Club of St Anthony's College and Forefront Media, and I would also like to take this opportunity to express my gratitude to St Anthony's College and the Tourism Club, in particular, Sir Himango and Sir Daniel, for collaborating with us. I am Ibanginte Maori, and in today's edition of the Campus Talk, we will be discussing about. Festivals and tourism in the state of Meghalaya. So I would like to call all our panelists to the dais. Uh, first, I would like to introduce Dr. Rusevind Shangpliang, who is, who is a leader of the Voice of the People's Party. Sir Rusevind, please. I also would like to welcome Ba Kit Walang. Who is the founder of the Springboard Surprises? I would also like to introduce uh, Dr. Benjamin Lingdo. He is a professor uh, in the Department of Tourism and Hotel Management, Nehu. I would also like to welcome Ba Kit Shangpliang, who is the uh, managing member of the band Summer Salt. And uh, I also welcome Ba Roy Kupar Sindram, who is the president of the Hinyo Treb Youth Council. Now, I would just like to uh, inform all of you that this discussion will be both in English and Khasi for the benefit of all. One more panelist is uh, going to join us, uh, Baba Jopping Rope, who is the MDC of Ramrai Jirngam and the leader of the National People's Party, but he's yet to be here and he can join us anytime. So, like I've mentioned, this program will be both in Khasi and in English for the benefit of all our viewers and uh, our audience. The Ngashimi Ganikala, Bangan Aikuble, Yapi Baro, but Ngapadian Sobhai Pi, Shaganika program, Kajongi, Kabangi Kot, Ka Campus Stock, Kaba Lapalong, the Tourism Club, Jonga St. Anthony's College, Harinkat Kajinga Trey Lang, Jonga Forefront Media. But Kamat Ya Clementarasni, Kan Long Ha, Hagalokamat. Tourism uh, festivals, but tourism haga jalami glaya kata ki tamasa bagi kam jengok kai berthai haga jalami glaya. Di hashwa bangun stang ya ka ya kani ka discussion ke jengi mtasni. Jika ud bentip ya ki parlok ba kani ke jengi keren kani ke jengi tiri jeng mut jengi mtasni kan dah hak tin kasi bat paring kenang ba uba buan balanghi unyo ban snap. But ban snow tu ya ki jeng ai jeng mut la ni ke jengi tay hak kani keren san mtasni. So first of all, I would uh, like to ask um, each one of our panel to describe the word festival because we know the word festival is, um, uh, it has many meanings. So uh, in short, in brief, can you describe the word festival? And, uh, Angin sedang ni kong ni Dr. Rusvin Shangpliang. 
panel discussion te nakalyan jonga mangi crunch pang festival haka khasti kumangi i haki jingtho ki bala aina katlyan jong sarkar bat ki wei ki wei ru ki penon kam ka ketien tamasa te tamasa haki jing pet jonga hi menchua ki jingtho jong ki nongtho ki babon kadei ka sports nani ki jingle kai tamasa Ukasi pada upenukam ya kat ketien Hindi tamasha dan penuan hak kedua juga entertainment lani kijing lek soba. Tiap kata kadi kijing mud hak ketien kasi. Tiap lek seki wigi perlok panelis kin batai hak ketien English tu kunjung. Pak Kit. Good afternoon everyone and I'm really happy to be here. I usually don't really get up on stage and speak and do things like this. This is probably the first time I'm doing it. And I'm like happy to be here, happy to be with all my friends here. Uh, to me, uh, having been involved in festivals for many, many years now, uh, to me a festival is a gathering of people, gathering of people, uh, like-minded people, to kind of get together and uh, maybe let, I got long hair, to let their hair down and just enjoy themselves for a little, little bit of time, uh, considering the kind of festival that someone's uh, put, putting together. Yep. Thank you, Bakit. Uh, Dr. Benjamin. Uh, thank you, Kong Ivan. Uh, in English, mo, I'll give the explanation. Festival is basically uh, a coming together of people to celebrate a certain uh, phenomenon or uh, to commemorate a certain um, event or a certain person or uh, a certain um, you know thing that we normally practice in our culture or in our tradition. It can be anything, right? So basically that is a festival. The important thing over here is that there must be a coming together of people and in the coming together of people there must be a certain objective, a certain goal for which we have come together. We don't come together in a festival at random. Then it doesn't become a festival. There must be something which brings all these people together to celebrate this particular phenomenon. It can be anything. It can be a person, it can be a culture, it can be a thing, it can be anything at all. Right, but something has to be there, people and a celebration. Thank you. Ba Check. Check. Bakit? Uh, thank you, Iban, for having me here. Uh, to respond to your question, I think uh, it's so, uh, slightly similar to what uh, Dr. Benjamin had already said. Uh, uh, I believe that you know a festival uh, is a get together of uh, community or communities uh, bonded by you know same sort of uh, belief and if you look at uh, the history of the Khasi people you know the festivals are not really uh, something foreign uh, to our uh, uh, to our entity so but if you also look at the history uh, of this land and its people uh, you you also know that you know festivals come with a lot of you know sense of purpose. Uh, so there is uh, you know this uh, uh, expectation that after the festival, what do we gain as a community? So it goes beyond the word tamasha, and I think we probably have to find a new word. Or if it's already there, I don't know in Khasi, but I think uh, there's a lot of you know sense of of purpose if we speak about the festival of the land and its people here. Thank you, Bakit. Baroy? So, Kublai Shibun, Yai Kong Iban, for Front Media, Kumjo Ruk, Yaka St. Anthony's Club and St. Anthony's College, Kumjo Riki, para panelists. Now, try Banjuba, because in Kalim, Kambut Youth Festival, is Dr. Rosubian Laong, Kadei Hakteen Kasi, Barabor, Naka Sorkar, Gipanon Kami, Kentin Tamasa. Ajing siang na so we have ekai kebaong iba akit bakla day kapuar pengin wat dah kawe kejeng bud yang kena kentian. Hiya kejeng soto kejeng i kejeng festival ka hoi kawan dah kekentian festivities lani kejeng lek kemen. But kadon lu lah kejeng kejeng bud bahag pengi lek i kini kiki festival lani kita masa fair fair. Tadi ngi pet ya ka mau ke festival kalak menlong nam tak ketuk kaput ketem karuai kesiaw kejeng pen i kiki culture kejeng i kum kejai penrio. Di ngam snow ya hab kita kencing ong mah kentian kasih mengin ong tamasa lese kalau ada kapuar pengin wat dah kui kentian. But then festivals 
kabomut di kalong kading jing le akemen kading wan jong kibriu lani kading lumlang jong kibriu ban le akemen ya ke ke la kalong ha culture ban pen i ya culture ka jong i la kalong ha ka ruai ka tem lani ha ka put ka tem but kiwe kiwe ki jing ya lum ya lang jong kibriu ban pet there is a purpose kemo ang kading mut di kalong ban pen i sa ka perthai ya ke ke bangi ngi don kata kari ka jing ai jing mut ka jong kebley ba roi ngi te ba Kejeng dek men, lani kata masa, ni apa nak dah kau yakin tin kau piang. Kejeng mudi kelong bang inwan raya borok kibrio, kerjo kerja ka. Henry, hari ni kis ni kibla leg, kini kita yau bla leg ni iba. Buon kejeng to, bat buon kejeng keren ni kat tu kat ni ngut kibrio. Halor kejeng mud, jong kejeng pelong, ya kini kiri rensan ya leg men, mo? Di, we all know that we 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 have heard, we have read. And we have seen statements from um, certain individuals on the meaning festivals and the, the expenditure incurred in holding such festivals. And many people feel that um, the word festival, um, when people say festival, they only mean, you know, kumbong iba, ba roy, kaput katem, karwai kasiao. Henry ki don bon jaj ki. Judging the men, kidon ki cultural festival, ki seasonal festival, harvest festival. Hindi kum upat ba nimnang ban 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 binta ay kata te ban batay siya ay kata. Te hagbay di ba kaniya? Ngakwa ban kili Dr. Rusven mo. Hagini ki haka autumn session jong ka yung dobar thaw ang gajalame glaya. U President jong ka sing Voice of the People Party i ba aden malabasay mo ilo ang Ba, ila keren haka yeng, and I quote, The government should stop all these kind of festivals in the state. But he did not specify which festival. Hatu ing mo ban ong baro kijaj festival. Lagi lay ka wangala ni ka syat nong krem. Fis ngaw ya ha, bat kata ka jing ong ka jong i ban kang lut no ikin ni kijaj tamasa baro. Ya baik Pak Arden, ini keren atau sengi apa ke sesiun. Jadi keren juga ini kamar Pak Iris ke debat directly ya kena seri pelosom festival. Dia ke PAD buat ke, bagi dulu kita pergi festival, kita pernah organize dan kesorkar. Dia ke Pak Iris, dia ketuka jengkeli, dia ketuka motion ke Pak Iris move. Kalau orang bahwa, ini keren buat directly, ya kena kena ke festival. Nama ialah penukam ke ketin, all kinds, all these kinds of festivals. All kinds of festivals. There are certain kinds, kan? But kerjemu jom ini kalau bayar kino kino ke festival, bal pelut put ia kapisah jom pat bah. Lain wastage of public funds. Di kino kino ke festival kita balung kumta nak kalian jom ke parti jom ini ikhwah hiban ke government kan remove. But what akan manifesto jom ke parti ruh ni labu harga public finance bah. Kino kino ke festival, kita memang rajin betul. Bagi kita kita harus pelong pelut kai penban ia ke pelatung kai jong kesurkar. Beri kepisah jong pat bak ini dengan pesangnya sendon. Kita kerja jemut jong ibar dan. Kumpul jemput bak. Ngakuah ben kli ini kerja kli ni bakit. Next question. Bila yang snow ia ke ia ke ke ketuka ke kerja matai kerja iba kerja i doktor Rusven. Hatu pis snow bak. Kum kini ki tamasa la ni kiren sanya lekmen ki long kajing lutput ya ke sorkar, bayar ke jela. Namar kum bayi ong i i i ba arden last time i ong ba. It does not reflect the culture and the traditions of the people of the state. Peace ngau yah be kata. Keren ar lightly gigi mo naman keren khasin marik kili khasin. Kapangan ning kong ngatrai. Nihap banyut biang yang kena ketin pelut, pelut kejeng pelut. Kehasi ngan persang banyut ketin investment ngan tip yadon kita sengtu hang ni. Nai kita kita hanya west sungi kita don ketin kebangan nama ngam day na west ngan akum klet. Tenrei kejeng pelut kemud ba wastage. P. Teka muda kan ni lah tapi pecah kiti jongkar ukum perkhat perdan jong kehasi ru. Let's say ni hap ban semua tu. Nampaknya kita kata tau pinpet ke business yang ni kamyat, cuma di banyak je. Nampak apa ke? Eh, kebang ni ni penlun dengan penlun kami sesi sian yang kekutian. Kemudian bertanya nak kelab nak orang tu. Hendak ingin perhat ke? Eh, 
investment ti kata kada ga we nre ka ba ar ha ba ya dei ba culture le si ga jing kra jing ba arlen ka la arab menta ba nakal yang jong kinong penya jong ni festival ki perhat ba dei bandon ka culture ni nira ega duit ara nira ega nakra ngin ngin persang ban wan kini kinong shot ba kinong tem no wa ken ko ba nyungut nomor nomor nyung de nomor ba long very significant ya ga jai ben riu jong ni ti kita gi gi ai ki ba nga trai bon na pelingki ni ki artis semakin don kumba sauk spa art ho ngut ki artis ki ban yo ya ka lat ban kamai lingba kani ka jing don jong ni ka program ti nga trai ngi hapan ya perkhat ba kumno ban sung tho ya kani ka ya kini ki festival namar dai lingba jong ni ki festival ru kata ngi mla ban len mo ngamong ba ro ki festival ki ni dai ban panjing ken kumno bana kumnu kumnu ya ka pisa la penya kumnu ha kono kurkom kumnu kawan kita gigi ingi dai ban panjing ken ka arti ai ka don bad bon ki lat ki bangi la benne tenrei ba kan long kum ka ktien ka ba bonong ban shu blanket mo ban shu ya keren bai ba barok ki festival yu ka tarang ni hapan ya perkhat yang sisin nomor ba kidon gigi ai ki ba yo jing mentoi fin pet ling ba ka gst ne fin pet ling ba ka ka ni ka gross earning haba ubreu u wan kum to ban na shabal ni paramni hang ni ru kilech ki festival mata ki don kam ka ja ki don kam ka sha ki don kam ka ja ki ja ka sa par kum ta ter ter ti kata kam long for free ti kini ki wei ki wei ki ba ya don menta ha kata ka festival da dakim de ki ki nong ruai ni ki tar ki yo ban talang ti nga trai ni hap ban perkhat da ka khli da ka jubing da ki ni perkhat han da ka jingsung ru kam long te tangi ta i bangadun bon ong te nrei ka e ka ba i ba arden ru kum perlok i ong atrai ka 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 don hi ka jing sisha bad ni hap ban kampen klan jani ka pan jing khen kata ka di ka jing ka jing su thu jong kan khubli shibun ba ket ngi su thu ba ki don shibun ngot ki priu ki ba yo ajeng men toi na ka jing perlong i ki ni ki rinsan ye le kemen la ki dei ki nong ruai ki nong ki nong ki nong put ki nong tem la ni ki nong di jing di mo ti kan ni ka jing ke li kan le kan ni jing li ka sakobe ka jing ke li kan le che i dr benjamin dr benjamin in one of your articles you focused on the unique selling point which is the beauty of nature in as far as tourism is concerned in the state of meghalaya you wrote and i quote to claim that festivals add to tourist inflows is a misnomer and you stress the need to conduct a proper cost benefit analysis can you elaborate on that okay um see first of all let me make something very clear when it comes to festivals and events and expositions and exhibitions and all types of mice uh, activities that we have mice here doesn't mean a mice or a mouse all right it means uh, meetings incentives conventions and exhibitions if uh, those from the tourism club you'll know about this so i have no problem with these things right uh, the problem that i have not exactly a problem but much more of a concern the concern that i have is that when the government of the day uses all types of reasons to justify the holding or not holding of a certain type of event not just cherry blossom anything at all across the board right my stand has always been very clear not just from this cherry blossom festival or any other festival even in the past my stand has always been very clear and i even today kong iban i still maintain my stand right if we want to do festivals let's do no problem i have no problem does it help in a certain way it does help in a certain way right but the only concern is that to make claims like it will help tourism it will help inflows and these sort of claims these are all misnomers because actually it should be the other way around festivals should not be that medium through which we are going to have more tourists we don't need more tourists in meghalaya you know this year we are going to have 15 lakhs tourists coming to our state in a state where the population is around 33 lakhs or 34 lakhs that's almost half the people floating in our state the whole year coming in and going out 
So actually what we need now is how to manage our tourism in a proper way so that we can get and reap all the benefits from these 15 lakh people who come into our state. You know, in tourism in our state, Kong Iban, kadon bahag ni ka leakage ngi ang hakten pareng leakage. Leakage means kibriya kiwan kenshin ye, kiwan pekaishin ye, kidon hang ni. Hindre ka revenue pat naki kamwan sa plajung ite. Kalik sekiwai pan without taking any names. We should not take names, right? The hang tang we need to manage our tourism kind. So when, for example, the honourable tourism minister yang bah kinwan ki tourists, kinwan ki foreigners, ki festivals, fine ki wan mudon bah deny kata. Hendre just to justify that you are saying so many tall things about tourism that is wrong kind. One thing, festivals and events are a part of tourism, right? We have to be very clear with the concepts here. Clear, but the approach should not be festivals should help tourism. Rather, we already have a very vibrant tourism environment in our state. We should use this environment in such a way that we can really promote and manage our tourism. And then from there, when we hold festivals, the benefits that we are going to get from festivals will be two, three, four times more than what we are going to get this time, this particular winter, the entire winter season in Meghalaya. Right? So that's why I, I, I said in that particular, it was basically an article where I was arguing my case. I, I thought this, this has to go out to the public. Mm -hmm. Right? So we, we have to be very careful. Right? Uh, Cherry Blossom is a very high fi festival, okay, where many people, they come. Indeed, and tickets, are, the rates are very, very high. So it's at a different level altogether. I mean, if you do a pecking order of festivals right now and events in our state, Cherry Blossom is number one, without a doubt. Gold medal, right? They are the winners, straight away. So, but, you know, Kashat Nong Krem recently and even in the past years. Shat Nong Krem, it's very near, right? Ja ayu hapa Shat Nong Krem. Kitu kinong de bapli kia de be hapa madan kumtu. For how many days? For two, three days. Kilin ki kong, piyo kandu, ngiyo kata, ngiyo kandi ba. And it ends there. You see, this is, this is the problem when you look at a certain medium called a festival to promote your tourism when actually it should be the other way around. You make your tourism strong, right? And then the benefits we are going to get from tourism by doing festival is going to be manifold. Like the Rio festival in Brazil. You can check later on. All the students are here. Right? Look at the audience who comes to that particular festival. Why? They are that type of audience. Because in Brazil, tourism is already very, very strong. Right? You have a very strong platform called tourism. Then you hold festivals. Then you really reap the benefits. And that time, I will tell you, Kong Iban, you will not reap the benefits only for two, three, four days. You will reap the benefits for three, four months in a year. Now tell me which one is better? I reap the benefits for three, four days, like in Shat Nong Krem, Kitaki Kong Gibran Hang Tua, then I reap the benefits for three, four months. You make your choice. Pick your option. Thank you, Dr. Benjamin. That was uh, an interest, uh, interesting and insightful uh, statement. Uh, my next question is for Bakit. Bakit, you're one of the uh, leading event managers in a state who have organized uh, a series of festivals. So, do you agree with Dr. Benjamin? Um, saying like, you know, we need a proper plan to uh, hold festivals so that it benefits the uh, people of the state for months in a row, not just for three to four days. And my next question is, do you think, uh, let's say 10 years ago, Meghalaya or Shillong would have come up to the stage where um, you know our exposure at present is not as bad as it was like say 20 or 30 years ago has such festivals in the past helped uh, put shillong and meghalaya in that tourism tourism map of the world uh, yeah so uh, for, first of all uh, i think that uh, festivals are, 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 are essential part of essential part of, uh, of the society in, 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 in a sense. But I think there should be a master plan. Everything should be done according to a plan. Right now, from my feeling, it's, it's kind of random, you know? Mm -hmm. Everything is done in a very random, random mat uh, manner. Like we really don't know next year, is Cherry Blossom gonna happen? Or another five years down the line, is Cherry Blossom gonna happen? Or is any other festival gonna happen? 
we know Shat Nong Krem, Wangalan are going to be happening forever, you know. That, that, that's a given. We're not too sure whether these modern day festivals are going to happen. How are they going to be sustainable? We have no idea. Because we, we, there's no way, there's, I don't think we've ever done an a, a analysis after the festival to see how helpful it really was for, for anybody. It's easy for I've organized big festivals. And I mean, most of the time, the festivals I have organized haven't been government fund, haven't been government funded. Like, government has been funding festivals just for the past, like maybe three, four, five years now. Back in the day, the government was not funding festivals, so we had to go look for sponsorship all over the all over the countryside. So when we first started off the Autumn Festival, we, that was long time ago, the first versions of Autumn Festival, which was 10 or 15 years ago, uh, there was there was no there was no hardly any government funding. We used to get something like five, six, seven lakhs for a festival, which is, which is nothing for a festival, but we went out to the market, and because of our friend R.G. Lingdor, who was there then, he, he was a minister of tourism that time, he was able to get the corporate sector to come in and support the festivals that we were doing. And because of, because of that, we were able to do the festivals back in, back in those days. And yes, at that point in time, it was very, very important that the festival happened because we were going through a little bit of a dark time in, our, in, in, in Shillong and all that, with the insurgency and all that. So when we did the first few autumn festivals, it did light a little bit of a spark, and a little, you know, people were people were a little bit, a uh, little bit, uh, maybe a little bit afraid and things like that, like tourists to come into our place because of the negative publicity we were getting. But a festival like Autumn Festival back then really lifted up the spirits and li lifted up this gloom that we had here. First year it was it worked out really well, and we broke two world records at, at that point in time, which really uh, took Shillong and put put us in the map, put us in the world map, you know. So, so yes, I think I think festivals are essential, but there has to be way to has to be a way for us to understand how is it benefiting us and who are the people are going to tell us is benefiting us. So what are the uh, what are the parameters that we use to to understand whether it's benefiting us in the long term or not? So I think those are those are some of the important points we have to look at. I, what was your second question? I'm sorry. Uh, sec you replied the, to the second question. To both of them. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Okay. So. Um, Kajikali jangan kaba kende ye i i ba roy kapar sendram. Tiba ngi ye i ba but dangshen ngi lah depan link ba ke forfront media ngi lah depan publish ke way ke documentary halor ki tamasa. Tiba ki ba buan ki ba keran hang tu ki day ki ba yang ki ba kersan but ki ba long persha ya kajing pelong ya kini ki tamasa. Tiba ki don ru ki nong ya don bentala ni kita ki stakeholders. Ki ba ong ba ngi don kam ya kum kini kijai festivals na mar ba ki ai ki ai jing mentoi kumi ki nong ruai ki ya ki nong bu stall nang ta ki taxi drivers ki arab ya ki begin yo ekam hai kaji ti pis ngau hok nani pis ngau day mo bangin kini lo ya taka hok kajong ki begin kamai. Si bun si ni kum ba ong mo ka topic. Of festivals and tourism in Meghalaya. The question that ngang ako abon kili balay ting yah abon ang festivals and tourism. Balay ka festivals kimla abon ang laka jong and tourism. Kung ang mo ka tourism minister he gets big big claim mah. The long festival kin one gibrio di kipaw haja di kilak di kiyu. Di ka jing kili ka long ba manu ban yon ang nakata. Lara fikiran si pang kita kinong di jing di mah. Lani kita kinong peni kiriam kibet. Lani kinong ruai. How many of them compared to the population of Meghalaya? Kung ang iba ay Dr. Benjamin Menea, kito kikong kibadi hapo hapo ka shat sok ng ka shat ng krem ay katno kiyo nong maki. But hang niya lay fi niya ban so tuk kawayro. Babalay ka sorkar ka ban pulut pisa hakum kini kiki commercial festival. Cherry Blossom is not a cultural festival, a musical festival. Rather, it is a commercial festival. Can benefit yano manu ban yo nong kan yo nong ka sorkar. If you make an investment, if you make an investment in any business, Ayuma, you you expect to get some profit, or you rather you'll get some profit. But then in this type of festival, kabal government, two crores of the public money will be invested in Cherry Blossom Festival. Let let's take a, a, an example of Cherry Blossom Festival. Two crores of public money. Two crores of public money means two kilometer of good road. Two crores of public money means four classrooms in the rural area. Or it rather means two or three PHC or health center, but then you invest that money. Haka cherry blossom kabanom ayeh ayeh ya kesorkar megalia. If you invest arkru and rekam don pakajuba now na kesorkar banong balaring invest arkru ngin yok kat ni kapisa. Fila dan fipet ya 
I was going through the website, John Kiniki, uh, ki, uh, the manage, uh, the even the management agency, mo, Kaban Penyat, Jaka Cherry Blossom. They are pricing the tickets at around 1400 per day or 3600 for three days. You have a VIP pass of 14000 for three days. You have a VIP pass of 5000 per day and then the add ons of four, uh, say 4000 per day. See, if you, get, if you take an average, of a, if they sell the tickets for 2,000, if they have, they are expecting that people will come around 90,000 will be the visitors of Cherry Blossom. So you multiply the 2,000 into 90,000, how much money they are earning? 18 crores. Take the food, the, the stall that will be there in Cherry Blossom uh, venues, that will not be free. They'll be charging those vendors. So that, that profit that I'm, uh, I'm saying, they say that Kajing Pulut, estimated budget is 9 crores. Even if they sell the tickets at 2,000, if they are expecting 90,000 people to turn up to the events, they are getting 18 crores. Now the question is the 9 crores to whom they'll go. Will the government get even a, a crore from that profit? See, we are investing as a, as a business man. If I'm investing in something, I should get a return. And from that return, I could do something else. The first autumn festival Kabapulong. Nakatuka documentary ka ba pipile i kren i ba larseng sawian mo yong ba the first autumn festival bangile ka jingyo nong ka bangiyo nang tu ngile ban invest apo maulon nong will these organizer ki bale ka cherry blossom kin ong kumta la nga yo nong shfokro na ka cherry blossom ngan ai la ning an invest ka state ka jong em it'll be pocketed by some people who have an interest in those i i am not saying name who will be pocketed by no but then the profit will not come to the state. And second thing, see the concept of double taxation also I'm saying. I'm a taxpayer. My money is being invested in holding of cherry blossom. And at the same time, if I have to go and, and take part in cherry blossom, I have to pay for the, for the tickets, for entering the, the venue. Why? My money is being invested and at the same time I'm being asked to pay. That's, all the, that's double taxation. If, I'm in, if my tax money is being invested, I should be allowed to go free in the venue. See, what, what we are concerned is that as an NGO, as a pressure group, we are not against festival, we are not against these kind of events, but what we are concerned is that the state which has a deficit budget of 1,500 crores cannot afford to waste even two crores of money. As they say is that no little drops of water make an ocean. So these two crores here, two crores there, next you have the Tri Hills Ensemble Festival in the next few weeks. That is a complete waste of public money. So we are, we are not against festival, but the way that if you want to hold festival, you do it like Bakit is doing. No need for the help from the government. If you earn 100 crores also, it's your money. Don't waste the public money. That is what we feel. Mm. I'd like to respond yes, to, uh, Bakit. Okay. Uh, we are all friends here, Roy. Uh, we just perform at the HYC, uh, this thing, but I, I have a different take. You know why? Because... Uh, uh, because I am in touch with all these people, because all the conversation around town, and I talk to the uh, friends of organizers and of the festival and all of that. So uh, I have different data to, to, to present. Uh, first of all, the, there are 3,000 tickets bought by people from outside. So let's assume that these are tourists for sure. And if each tourist spends uh, about 20,000 uh, rupees, okay, tickets, food, stay, and all of that. So the, the earning through GST will, I'm not defending the government, or please don't, but I'm just trying to defend my position. If I have to go and participate, uh, then you know, it has to be some purpose to me. I started with a purpose, please uh, don't forget that. And it has to make sense to me financially also, uh, you know, because we are all citizens of the state. Now, uh, you will get 3,000 tourists spending 15K to 20K each in two, three days. Uh, you will earn a GST of at least six, uh, six, six to seven crores, okay? Uh, that, that's pure GST. But yes, uh, Baroi, it will be difficult to quantify that. I mean, you will need another maybe department to actually <laughs> go and see how all of this, you know, you, you need a different system. But this is another side of the fact, number one. And number two is something that slipped my mind. 
I, I, I totally, uh, it, just, it just slipped my mind. I'll just, I'll just come back to that when it comes to, uh, what was the, the other one? Oh, Tri Hills Festival. Tri Hills Festival, uh, I'm also uh, distantly part of the festival, so I know that Tri Hills Festival, uh, the money is, uh, does not come from uh, the state and government. This is part of the Ministry of uh, um, Tribal Affairs, that's right, Tribal Affairs, where the money comes from the central government. It's called, it's under the Jan Jayan, Jan Janan Divas, I think uh, one of those, uh, I'm very bad in, in, in Hindi, but uh, rest assured that this money comes from there. But of course, agreeing with you, uh, I think there has to be a better system. Uh, to, 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 to ask for, you know, what kind of investment, how, uh, you know, money comes back. So those things uh, are something which we have to, to keep in mind. Yes, Waki. Uh, yeah, so uh, regarding this whole, regarding this whole in income generation part of a festival, so I think uh, people have got a very, very uh, kind of a wrong idea with regards to the amount of money that comes into a festival. I've been involved in NH7, which is probably the biggest festival that ever happened over here. And let me tell you, from the, from the, ticket, mon from the ticket money pays only half the bill of a, of a festival of that scale. The ticket money pays half the thing. Because people, when it came to NH7, they were telling, they, there's news saying 20, 30,000, 50,000 people came. In reality, there's this, the capacity of that venue was 15,000. So first of all, when you see 50, not many people have seen 15,000 people. So when you see 15,000 people, for a, for, a, for a regular person, they'll say, oh, one lakh people were there, whatever, you know. So I think that's another very, uh, very important thing that we have to understand that most festivals, I don't know about in Meghalaya, but outside also, they run 50% on uh, ticket income and 50% on sponsorship. That's how tickets, uh, that's how festivals are usually run. Okay, okay? so it's not, it's not like uh, all the ticket money, we're going to get this many crores and all that. Even down there at, uh, at, at the venue in Riboy, there's no way more than 15,000 or 20,000 people can fit in there. 20,000 people is a huge number of people. I mean, uh, we've, we've always make a mistake with looking at audiences and thinking lakhs of people come. There's no event that's ever happened where 50,000, 50, 50,000 people, never. 30,000 people, never. In Meghalaya, there's been no ticketed event where that many people have come. It's always the, the biggest ones probably have been 15 or 20,000 people so far. Okay. Thank you, Baki. Yes, uh, Dr. Rosevin, you wanted to say something? Yeah, with regards to the uh, people who are involved in the festivals, such as uh, artists, youths, unemployed youths, then uh, taxi drivers, but wait, wait, eh? Kumba Pilapani, you got documentary, Jongpi. We have to admit that. These festivals are a one-day affair or two days affair and they are not going to help or have a lasting impact on those stakeholders. Like a government can be organized a festival, it can be a long-term impact. I can't jump into the video. 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 Ray, maskur kato ki jano. Shano ki jak government kam tip. Kam la ban track aki. Na yakar ni yakata ticket limo. Kajing yo kat no, kajing lut kat no. Yakitu ki artist kan. Ki badang ki budding artist, young artist. Talent ki papir papir. Nde shoot tang ki nung ruwain ray ki way ki way ru mo. Teka government kam la ban track aki. Kasu haka karteng jung ki. Penun kami ki. Ban kamai ka pisa. Ban ndradep ka festival um tip shoot shano ki don. Tila dah dekat government ke pusat, hanya kapan perlongi ke festival, senapan mana ki music schools, mana ki institution, mana ki kino kino ki lahat, ki avenues, ki pelak pun ayam ayam ki, bagi pelak pun perform. Nak kata kata orang ini nak kalian juga party, nak pun keren nama orang nak kalian juga party, ni bu akan manifesto jom ini, kau bagi point. Ba, ni don kapan promote ki local artist, bagi naik ke stage ki, bagi export ki, sabar. Nde bang ju ju pelong kai ke festival dah ke pisah jom pat pat ju alat ekip bikin ruai bikin dia perform tu hari ini tu kira no kata kali kau ikut bang kuat penpaun nak kalian juga. Kebelah ibu dan doktor kencing telah sengut nat kata kencing kira kencing ladai bab bab job idon rekad bagi hangi nama rba in yok keren 
nakalian kesorka nama ki pun ki ki mat ke bapila pasal hak ni ke por kum kita ki jingmi ki jingyo hen rei na barba im shimla don ting in chu ya ngin ha ban chu azium mo ke sorkar kum bai ong i ba poling do i bentri ke katna ki kamen chu kai perthei ba ngi don ya kita ki record sing hab chu yang ngek kum ta ya men ta ngong Tang bagi don lagi bagi lar, kita bagi lar ban shim, kumpa ilapan pau i bagit ne i doktor Benjamin mana bagi lar ban file RTI, ban lar ikit lagi record sebab tu. Ti ke keben, hoi ba. Ikan bayong ba sang peliang, ngaruk ba sang peliang, parakur, kami dah ikan bajam mau punya keren, punca bukan yang ruk perlok, sang mon ruk perlok, sang ramon ruk kur. Tak mahu sulung kum ni, kat kum kerjus itu, jadi nak ada kuiperman suah, bagi nang dia kam dia kena. Kalau ngap kapor, kau bagi yo kalat ban dia perform, hari kipu pun ki festival, kau nado man suah, kau kenal kau bagi roots festival kau bagi bakit, i penlong hang teh beran jorong heb. Di kitu kipor, ki long kum ngak keren bet naga kum artis mo. Ngam lah hi bandong band defend tak orang menurut kalau heh pelat kencing pakala labun pelat. Tang ba kasulong kasulong kum ni. Hak ba ngiyo ya kono kono kerensan kat nang bun kaya rapingi. Di lada kadei kata ceri blossom ne kadei ibu dasar kway blossom ruk kamilai ngiyo ban peni ya kisap bat kaya rapingi bangin nang kamp nba. Di na itu kenal bagi nang ya bagi nang ong ngat rayin kenal. Panginnya tiap minggu suatu, kasur ulang batar jangkar ke ayo. Dan rekat menang yuk di bawah pada kaya rap. Di kajing temu jong kandi kerensan rukot pun kajing yasuh jangan seng peliang. Kalong ba nang ni kin pak pada kin jid ya gitu kiba ayo kin pak ya ki syabar. Bat kin tau kalat lenti bagin dek syabar. Di kata ngam tiap di kapalan gorman ni rekat menang yasuh nomor ngang yajan bahawa kini ki. Nampak ni lagi artis. Di hendai dega bawa ngom ta kadei gaba ngin nang hap an kampen jenai kan? Nanti kita giplan berkhut. Nampak kadei gaba piang piru kadei ngin hap an kampen jenai bahkan don ke sistem bahkan don ke accountability sistem kapan dah yoi bagi ni kimi nang ta kita cerita. Di bat kita ki sakawai nong bawa perhat nong ban ong bawa kesorkar kami leh lut ru pay to education. Minta pinong kesorkar kami leh yo. Hendak kita pun hi kita kisah ini senyang lang jong kisnong kita tahu kita lang berkom ta ter ter. Ti wat hak art dan culture orang try ke music ngapet kan long hi hak kata kerukom. Ti ya ke ay ke ba ke benta ke ba ke day ban le kan le dan raya ki ay berdaki don hi bangi hak ban ya don benta lang banyarap ya ladi dah ladi. Ti tangi tay bang kau. Kebeli coba pakit nama p p keren ikut kamat ke ba ong ba ki artis ki nong ruai mo. Pisau kumno pada jab ni crunch pangkar way kesiaw ni kepok kepok ketem. Pisau kumno halor ketu ka project jangka sorkar pada ketu ka megalaya that grassroot project mo face that koi grassroot bagi ailat ya ki yes pakit bagi ailat ya ki ni ki budding artists to you know providing them a platform to showcase their talent. Yeah, so all of you all here heard of MGMP? Have you all heard of MGMP, Meghalaya Grassroots Music Project? Must have, no? Yeah, so uh, that was a project that actually I came up with. I, I, I made this, I made this pr proposal to the government and gave it to them, uh, thinking that we, we need to have a long, like, a, like a, a project that is long term and a little bit more sustainable, where we have lots of small, small happenings throughout the year, rather than have, and, and culminating maybe in something, something larger, but uh, that that was something that uh, I that was the that was the concept behind my behind uh, behind me going to the uh, going and giving uh, Dr. Vijay Kumar the uh, uh, the proposal. You know, actually, they, uh, Dr. Kumar and the rest of the uh, Vijay Kumar and the rest of the tourism department had called musicians and all of us together for a meeting at Pinewood. Kit was also Kit was also uh, part of the meeting. We had one meeting in the Pine, at Pinewood Hotel, and when that that got over. Uh, I came back. I came back home, and I, actually, I have a, I have a, I have a document at home and, uh, that I've been working on for many years, talking about trying to make, talking about uh, making, uh, the ent like an entertainment industry in Meghalaya. You know, that was that is my that is my this big thing that I have in my head that we need an, uh, we need entertainment to have an industry status so that 
there are many benefits come across for, to everybody involved in, in the long run. Yeah? So when we had that, after that first meeting, when that thing got over, COVID hit us and nothing happened for a few years. Then I got a call from the tourism office one day calling us for the second meeting, which was attended by myself, Kit, my brother Rudy, and just a, a few other musicians. And uh, over there, I came to know that the government wanted to find out how they could connect music and tourism. And I had gone with the, my, like my big master plan about uh, my, uh, this whole industry thing. And when I was tr talking about industry thing, it was, I, I, get, I guess it was too lengthy, so they said, just this concentrate on tourism and uh, music and tourism, how do we connect the two? So I went back home that night and I kind of went through my document and I pulled out, pulled out things. So one of them was MGMP, so I, I, one of them was the Meghalaya Grassroots Music Project. Then I wanted to, I don't know, many of you all probably are too young to know that uh, Shillong was very famous for having faiths before, yes. community faiths. There was no talk about festivals before. These, mu these, uh, these modern day festivals were not part of our vocabulary before. It was all uh, community based faiths. And I really think, and I really still think that we need to bring those back. Uh, this fest festival, festival thing is all over, the, all over the country. Festivals is a big word. And I think that faiths, to me personally, is a much, much cuter kind of a word, you know, where, where communities get together and then. Uh, you know, small things like this happen, which can ultimately cultivate in some, uh, cult, uh, yeah, accumulate in something big. So I put that down. I said, like, why don't we, why don't we be original like Shillong always was? Shillong was always known as the pioneers when it came to music, you know, in the, in the whole of Northeast. So I said, why don't we stick to the stuff that we know and we were already doing? And one of them was, one of them was faiths. Uh, so I put that down and um, I, I put that down and I also spoke about uh, funding uh, artists to go and tour, you know, like small, small artists to go and tour around the country, like getting a fund for artists to tour. So these were the few things that I put down and I said, okay, these are the ways, these are the ways I think we can combine tourism and tourism and music. And they took, they took the MGMP uh, from there and I think MGMP is a very successful, uh, successful happening that the tourism department has done. And it's, uh, they, they're, I think they're spending small amounts of money, but throughout the year, rather than blowing up this whole big whole big thing. I'm not, against, I'm not against festivals, okay, I'm an event manager. I cannot be against festivals, but I'm a little bit conscious also about how do, how do we use our money, you know. I'm, a little bit, I'm conscious about that too, you know. So I think we just need to find a balance where, where, where the, money spent is, uh, the money spent is spent wisely and that, that's about it. Okay, yeah. thank you, Bakit. Uh, of course, there are several criticisms to the uh, MGMP uh, project as well, but let's not talk about that because we're talking about festivals right now. Um, uh, I, the next, uh, uh, I will ask the next question, and it basically has to do with the purpose of a festival, the the aesthetics of the festival. But before I go ahead with that question, I first would like to ask Pakit, when you first organized the autumn festival, what was the purpose of organizing that festival? Uh, so, so the, to give you a little bit of a background, uh, the first time uh, my company Springboard organized Autumn Festival was not with MTDF. This was one year before MTDF. So I, was, I, was, I had just started off getting into events. That time nobody knew, the, the word event manager was not even, there was not even the word event management around here, you know. So, so that, what happened was I was, I, w I was doing self-funded small events like dances in Pinewood, the Bob Marley show, like small, small events. I was, myself and my partner used to run to Guwahati, walk the whole of Guwahati, look for sponsorship. You know, we did that for many years. We walked the streets of Guwahati, going to companies. We got rejected, 99% of the time we got rejected. And then one day, uh, I got a call from the DC office when Bar Donald Walang was the DC, and he, he called me up and he said, uh, Keith, I've been, I've been watching and I've been seeing that you've been doing lots of these small, small events this past year, like, all on, your, on your own. So, uh, and he was also the managing director of MTDC. So he tells me like, Keith, uh, so uh, I've, just become the, I, I've just become the managing director of MTDC. We have a little bit of fun. We have five lakhs. So can, tell you, can you tell me what you can do with this? We want to do, we want to do something. Like we, th we thought of the Autumn Festival. So I was blown away. Like someone telling me like, we're gonna give you five lakhs when, when we used to get 10,000 and 5,000 as sponsorship. Suddenly someone tells me, wow, five lakhs. So we said, yeah, bah, we, we will do a, we'll do a three-day festival for you with five lakhs. So, so that's how the first year was done, was, was done with, uh, with MTDC, actually. Then after that, when my friend uh, Baarji uh, came to power, and he, I mean, he won the election and became the Minister of Tourism, and he f set up MTDF, the Meghalaya Tourism Development Co uh, uh, Forum. 
and together with them we said like uh, we said why don't we take the autumn festival forward and that time um, uh, shillong and meghalaya was going through like in the insurgency phase you know so it was quite it was quite dull the whole town was quite dull and all that so th so he came forward and said why don't we use this festival to let people know that shillong is uh, you can still come to shillong like tourists you can still come to shillong and enjoy yourself it's not as bad as you think it is because you know how how the press actually sometimes blows things out of proportion especially coming from the northeast of india you know so he said let's let's, let's do this and he called we called it positive vibrations so he said like positive vibrations come to shillong and we'll use this festival as a springboard for like opening up opening up tourism in this area you know thank you baki we know that every festival has its own meaning like the shat nokram it has its own meaning the wangala dance or the autumn fest that you mentioned now no offense to anyone in this panel or outside the panel uh let's take for example the cherry blossom that is going to be held uh from the 19th so, sorry 17 till the 19 uh we talk about cherry blossom that means we celebrate the tree cherry blossom but from the talks uh, that has been going on around town it seems like the cherry blossom is not about the tree it's about the fest i mean the fun the performances the food and everything that that particular event is going to offer so are we losing out on the real meaning of you know celebrating this particular tree that the that, that shillong is famous for are we keeping track of the number of trees that are there in the state are we engaging the community not in co-hosting any festival but in uh, planting and maintaining these trees are we keeping a track of any of that maybe yeah dr isvin if you can uh that is very interesting he when i was searching about the meaning of this cherry blossom tree i find it very difficult especially in khasi don't keep on about the uding leng don't keep on about the uding leng the khar ding leng khasi don't keep on about the uso so terkun so terkun uding terkun uti terkun hanga marwai te ima la de u so ne uding ne u ti tenang mala sebut tenang pi uni us u di ni usok mo ka badai cherry blossom kering celebrate dia u kawan ka ri japan ni penbut ya ka e bagi le japan bat ca japan uni u di tu sentiu bami udah pu bro ko bagi kumpa si hajar tadi ke location apo japan japan kembali ke bahe kari upo keleng keleng pada itnat ba ba kitu ki ding bijar ngambar ko ki jalut umi uni sutio nalor kata ki don ko pas poutli ki 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 town big town semua ki nomba ki bahe bahe ki bas celebrate ba pelong ye ki ki ya kan ki festival sepo japan ba ki brew ki la jang tu ki song hatra jung tu ding ki abam piknik ni ki adi sha la ni kum ta kan ki arwai hakata ko ban pe ki tu ding men sngi men mie pada kila ai sikit lights itu nak ba kila ban pejapo youtube bat keling mo te ketu ke festival napo japan kali sapo usa kali kiwi jakaru bat ki adopt ya ketu ka culture napo isani sangi ding ceri bosom rutang kan uteli dang la ban nyau ndali satu sapo boy kur kalang mentale tang wei ceri bosom rum don le pelong sendan hang tu Tu turis supaya wanang ti itu mudur pi. Balak pek ya kadur, lak pek ki video ski pangisna. Mo, ba itnat ba. Mar ka dikah festival ke ba high end, mo, high level festival. Te lak mutrain lak point tu mandar ku kalang ta ni sundur nak uding ceri bosom. Nda poi hang tu don kading terkang, don kading ayu, ding ayu. Fi. Katu ke dikah ki bang imut persen ki turis, bum tu imut promote ki turis. Nah, saya kira panelis badan buram kira badan mana akan kapor kini agri kita mohon. Kalau katu ke essence jom katu seri blossom bulu adu, jom ke festival bulu adu, jom ke tourism ni tenaya keren. Nama rupa pimut ban peran kami ya utau dieng, lani ya kita ke festival ban promote ya tourism. Mo, promote ya tourism tekamut pihak yang lama yang mikir tu kita tourism bagi nawan hang tua po 
Nani ha shilong, nani ha tong lo tukam matan po bohoi mo mta. Kina wanang tu pinong iki pek ngidon ka chakas po mulundong mo, sipo sora, sa nartiang, sa musun ram, keleng keleng, sa po ogas ka si hills, ki buon pa ki chaka, te pek ngidon kini ki pan jalam e pi kum ta, kum ta, kum ta. Pinuot pan le e kata kum ta, kum ta. Ka surok kreng kreng, ta ban yai u trash nong ru mlong, wan su utores ka no ka jing chak burom. Nalon nak ta, Torres Bapri lawan tadi kipor bom lah mesti kena seno kendong leh lawan lah pun sayang neng lah thay lah poy sayang hotel musum no mendon light sum sekarang peja sasi pang lip sekala jah sam mobile bateri kum kata kastiat ni don kaji mu cunga pengakren ya kata kalau ngapa ngingi par biang ya ki facilities lah ni ki basic primary necessities We don't have those necessities in our state to cater to the locals or to the tourists. So why do you want to to lie to the tourists to say that yes, come here, everything is cherry blossom. That's why. That's why. That is my point of view. So we have to be 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 careful. Ini panlong sumar pa pangi mo panlong kumini festival hoy ngan si perkut mo niya kibun kib festival mo. So pelang festival yang sudah, yang yang pelang yang sudah, ya bam so pelang, ya bam yang pelang, mentah kasni kadang ke festival Amur Falcon, mo Falcon day, mi si syak itu, nang tak ke festival kita pun jai, kita don, bagi dah pendon kami si syak ni katu, kita mood, kini saya diprosom kadei tangka cover up, jongka government ya ka failure jongka, ban cover up, bat ban beli empat ya ka. Hmm, baju pendon kamu baklah exploit, ya ki youth, ya ki artis, bat ya ka public funding. Tengah tengah itu itu we jengkeli nama arba i piang ba your last point where you mentioned baki exploit ki artis. I just wanted to ask an artist here. Do you think that is exploiting the artist? And I feel I've never been ex. I mean I've been exploited, but not by cherry blossom. Ngasuk, ngasuk kau harus menang bah. Hot, utau cherry blossom, ulah pun wan na Jepun, ulah pun wan na Kohima kata angin tip. Hendry kadang tu kecik sisa, kebang kan tu nak pedang jupi bila jio, semua jio si nak nak naga, si naga bi itu perit deh. Ah, pitip itu wan na, wan na, na naga lan M. Utu udai u Japanese breed, napa naga saki. Nak kata kata aku yang siet naga. Tiada syair udah dan su naga festival ngam tip kini kalau belong dengan kui. Tenrei haba pipe ya kini kau duit tarajo ngiru. Ar spa senam lay spa senam mensua. Kidon kejing yatho kana ke history ba kini kejing tembru kam day kejongi. Tenrei ke UNESCO kong. Lada pipenon kami ya kanu kanu katiar. Kalau abang dek dek sluding ni, kalau abang dek suki ni, kemulan ni, kedutaran ni, gay. Palat dek sih pas ni. Um don show menu menu bila abang keli menong oh kandi kandi kejongi buat pipenon kam. Nak kata kadau kadon ke assimilation, kadon ke assimilated culture. Mu, ti pinjai perkhat ya ki ya ki jangan spong kasih jongi senana asam. Dang ta ya ya kanara besar mimi jongi senana asam. Tinggi hapanya perkhat gay. Ingin numpnya pongsu ini ru, tiu tau cherry blossom ru, ingin numpya ula wan siang ni, bat ni ula penitenat ini, ting mentau lah siang kan nunga try lagi kasan pause senam sih pas senam ula siang ni ting ingin num ingin num sumar sih u, apa kado tiu tiu jing tau, o tiu jing tung ba ayu play, ha, ting ingin hapan sumar, ting 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 kumbang paring we are majoring on the minors. We are majoring on the minors. We have to be big-hearted about that. You, kata kata sulung ba, you kata kata kerajaan ngah tengah melak penong eh, bila berjob ikhwan ngam day bangang ngam kuat pun pelong political nama ngam day politician. Then ray ngah syukuran bay tang mentai position lejong, ba yang ihi ki festival ki day ki bayarap yang ihi kungki artist. Ti lada ki bayarap hak kanu korukom ihi hak Nampak ni hap menang ban quantify ruang kita ini paling. Nadang ni 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 perform macam ni berasa mentah. Ubrio uyo i 
ha Bangalore ukhot namar o pidang perform kat kata ke ciri blossom ka pa perform bad uron and kiting bad unniyo o pidai pi kata ho to rimla to ban ban ra to niyo so Bangalore ngi wan na ta kada ha kala artrik ni hadin dong ciri blossom artrik desember bagi tip nang ta ki khot yang i biang sa Bangalore ti kita ki long ni hapan perkhat mdei ban ong bon siyo tang nang ni ho mla ban besa khun ban besa mo ban yala di kpo ten rei ki ni jing perform kawai hadin kawai ni kawai kaya rap ni bede ban build ki ka profile ki ngi ti de ha kata kar kom ka yarap ya ki artist ti ngi hapan ni sungtu lain kata namar le singi pai olat ban ni sungtu ti le si Hendrai kejing ai jing ken kejing pan jing ken ke dewan dan sasi sini kata ngaban biang kubli. Dr. Benjamin. Hang ni don uding cherry blossom. Ha. Just next itu uding don u ding se. Undan bubu status you ding se bubli. Berokoi ki bubu status tang you cherry blossom. Just on the lighter side. Mo ke ik mang ngabut ban ong kolong ba. Oi he raised the point along very valid uni uding udi uding ayu iba sang piang yong ba roots jong ude na po japan iba kit ila patai kum tu te haka jingi i jong a hi ka cherry blossom kum bolong menta mo pe mo la dang i kren ka sha nong krem it's our culture mo ni celebrate ka culture ka jong i ki bria ki wan ki pet Ada ke culture ke jungi. Bam yang pelang very recently ke jah. That is also he try and promote ikut ke region in terms of tourism. Ti iba tambor hang tu, but ki perlok jungi hang tu. Kile ikut ke festival macam yang bah through this and social media ki perlu kan tiap le sekian macam ciki jaka jungi. Cherry Blossom Festival kani kadai jeng suhu jungi amo. Kadai mday boong monum lo. This is my observation. Ngapet ngaanalyze, but ngakonclude kumde. What is cherry blossom as of today? As of today, he cherry blossom kadai be festivity. It is purely a festival. Hagba kibriyo kia wan lang, kia rwai, kia put, kia tem, kia shad. Mo kadai be kata. I think yangi he kum kastiet ko jungi menta ban sedang ban relate mo bad uni udieng bo pi ong pi men ne uni udieng nga nga mi i ha ko no guru komba uni udieng udei uta ubang ngi ha bandala ya pet palat in the context of cherry blossom ka shulong ba ka dei ka por bo uni udieng upo sentiu and you needed something at the center stage so that on the basis of that kumong ong kamene te there must be a certain goal a certain objective pila ban le something around that Day, di menta in the cherry blossom festival, gembong iba van mana yang bawa umdon dia ngangam perjumpa itu ke Jakarta ngam tip. I cannot comment on that. Teh nai yang bawa umdon dia cherry blossom, teh I'll go by him bawa umdon utau dia cherry blossom. Tapi nak tak ada kini ngong. In my observation, kalong by a celebration of a certain type of festival, a festivity, kiai wai, kiai shad, kiai tem, kiai put. Teh nai kabakut hi kong iban ngan ong ipi. I'll go back to my original point. Mo. Kata ka cost benefit analysis ni hapan le, ka jingken ni hapan le, the government na marba kalong responsible ni kibriyo, let's say it'll be good lala ka I report, ka nungot kita kibriyo kibayawan in total different days, ka pisa ka nung ka late, ka pisa ka nung ka wan, mano bayo ka nung, if at all it is possible. Tehendri ke eko badon kam for me hi, na mar nga 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 Kibrio kia keren kiki distinguished festivals and events and and tourism and ha and and development and all that. Ringa pat hakajing pet jong ha ngai iba everything actually they are interconnected. They all come actually in the in in the same place. Mo te ke ek bang idon kam ban pet mangi kum kastiet kolong ba idon kam yaki interventions kibani rap yaki kena samla yaki kastiet borok gawehi in a very sustainable manner. Into the long term, and what is the way out for that? Pet yikin yikin avenues hakaba ngila aban invest. Kenang ba kastiet kajongi, kibri kajongi, kini kikna samla kini your employment opportunities lasai. Kabolong sustainable, lasting into the long term. But kata kade ke ay, pi penbahay ka agriculture. Pi ngi hang ni menta em ngang. Pih ngang ada yang hapo Department of Tourism and Hotel Management. But I am the first person all the time. But you are man kapor. But our strong point is actually agriculture. Larangi pet cisha ika agriculture. Kerukom kebangi di ban pet. 
And then kasawan ka tourism, kasawan ka wiku hadian. After that, you don't come and pay. You can get areas. How about you don't come and invest? Bali agriculture. 67 percent of the population they depend on agriculture for livelihood. Ngamong mga the data of the state government is telling that, and it is true also. 67 percent of the population depend on agriculture for livelihood. Tourism le shakendong kadon. Mo kadon shakendong. The at the same time, when 67% of the population depends on agriculture, agriculture contributes only around 30% more to the state GDP. Kapamut kumdo, buon na kinongrep jungi kiduk, kiduna, kishitom, balay, ubriu ubuon hindi ka contribution ng tuo kaduna. Nakata buon na kinongrep jungi kiduk, let's kinong kendong jungi siya. Nene am borok hoi kia rep ban bam damit mundon pa perkat ban rep ban long commercial ya ka pila ban agi argue in terms of bakaterian kam long ngim de iplin ek ka biang kata everything is fine mo te hindi ladangi yet candidate we do about some research ngi yet in what sort of agriculture ngi laban invest horticulture floriculture right hang tang ngi don kam ngi ban pe ka dugur kam ngi laban le ti larangi one part ka tourism for me tourism in the state is number two number one is agriculture dangi one part isa ka isa ka tourism ngi don kam ban invest ya kata ha ta gur kam ba ngin pen ba ya ka service quality ka jongi ha ka jaka bam ha ka jaka sa ki kali ki banginya ka rukom long jungi ki brew ka rukom kren ka jungi ki brew ka jing pen internet ki jaka ngi don kam ban invest kum hai ki ta ki ak fitep kong i ban ngani thu ep phen le cha bon ki shnong jungi ha pori khasi jain tia manta baro khoj u ba bon u yele cbt lot community based tourism without understanding the very simple meaning kamot eu kata ka cbt ja eu ha ka bakut suede parking ticket i bash photeng ka de chips Manu bayu anong, yu anong pat siya wai kasi nong kayo ayu parking ticket and chips. And ja ayu after that, jabo ka jaka. Muna pa pun kuwai, ki try siya nong. Hadiin ka ta, ki sabla, ki complain. Bali ki complain, nga pun kuwai, man ka step, man ka meet, nga yu atang san fauteng ka. Of course, they will complain. Then, these are the areas actually we have to look into. Ya ka ba ngimpen? Mo, ngimpen. Just let me end. Mo, naman, see, it's okay. Like I said earlier, you want to do festivals, you do. Fine. Tambah, gimana dapat ban lose sight, yaki yaki areas hakaba actually ni don kau mandang invest mahkeng, mo. For example, mentah mo. Last, and I'll just wind up my point. Ni kran bah, yaki ni lembab bah. Kita 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 kena kibla kibla julek cepo sikim, nanti kibla apa sih sikim. Kita nak bah ban kuat, yaki ni ke example jengka sikim regarding transportation and all that, right? And there have been many times also where some of the political parties and some of the leaders and some of the Pressure group leaders, ki orang bah, kalau ada kapor bah, kiri kiri kali kapor na bah, berok hai, yang hantai hapo, hey, hantai hapo, kana para, lani hendak ISBT hang ni, anda nang ni syakmat kini lam kiri kali jugi, kacing kiri kiri kan dia. If we do that, tour as of today, siapa nama ta? The government decides will implement this from tomorrow. Mbak Sundram, mo, let's see. Nampak umdan pak abah job tinjau nampak Mbak Sundram, mo, siapa nama? Lada ka government ka decide menta kambing. Sanbaji, kong, we will start doing this from tomorrow morning. Tourism in Meghalaya will come crashing down. Why tourism in Meghalaya will come crashing down? Because we don't have the supply of vehicles. Ban ay kini, ban kit ng tu ban yalam keling keling. Hi, the solution is umday ban ong pin sange ngin yalam mangi. That is not the way. Mo, that is not the way. The solution is mangi, manga, mapi, mangi baro ngin ra ika capacity kujongi. Ingin long capable, ingin long able in that particular service, then umuran kamu pun penpor. Kalau long, la kalau long hi. Mo, si, if you ask me, do I agree? But tourism transportation hapo state jungi di bandle abe ki locals ki jungi, ki 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 citizens ne ki nong song nong jongka jongka state mekhalay jungi. Hundred percent I agree. Tang ba I don't agree with the approach of some people, parties and groups pan. Bo ang ba pin sangye, pin sangye te la shay lakut te tourism. Cherry blossom ni tenaya keren show, ni ni am lakut lah shy. Pi, so now kita nak students ni from the tourism club. I'm telling you, jele apa improve your capacity lah jong lah shy. Dala long capable am, mungkin nak kamera penbor. Kini kini long hiu ngaku aman sim dia ukhna nang ni napa ayu. Kita kasa, nada mangi hingi lah aman provide better food, beverages, service quality, accommodation am. Kita beri hi lah shy kini one spot sorak kini ngam kuak aman sa. 
hasilong ni any other place nga tinga kwa ban sa abe cha posora fi kare ka ta ka ba ngidon ka ban pet ka ba ngidon ka ban invest candid kan mo so that is my my only concern because in terms of development strategy he am we have to look at the bigger picture and connect all the dots they are all connected into one place i think the sustainable tourism ko phiong ka ta ka don ha po ka tourism policy ge jongi ka don and and ngan beteng candid mo tourism policy 2011 mo the very old policy that policy was actually with all due respect to the people who framed the policy it was basically a policy ba let's say ba ngi kham da ya pet ba ha ka nguru kom kin penya ya tourism tama mri lai 2011 we were very new in the field of tourism also the ka byang ta tourism policy 2023 which you will find now in the government website okay compare ka 2023 with the 2011 2023 is far better actually i'm i'm really happy with this policy namar ba hang to ki touch ki ki points but okhoi ki bang ong mentan all right all these points of ban train ki khna ban ban provide better service better hospitality better you know uh, uh, better of say ki ni ki chaka pet kai ban 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 involve ki grassroots in whatever tour very good but now fi policy is just on paper policy is just a guideline ko ong ngi bangin le kum ni but in the end we need strategies to make the policy work more they we have a long way to do we have a lot of things to do can they meant like a policy kala done everyone is happy now we let us frame policy uh, strategies kala ba kini ki policies ki padan ni la ban apply can like for example ban train ya ki khna ka nungot around 1000 youths every year are to be trained around 1000 it can be more also around 1000 youths are we are to be trained every year in the tourism sector in what food beverages accommodation transportation adventure activities everything you name them festivals song music dance drama everything you name them around 1000 right do we have the training facilities hang ta ke kami ke jingkeli fi in the paper it's fine i i'm number one wrong this is very good well done government of meghalaya but Do we have the training facilities? Hey, can you see how jam good? Can you pass pass good? Can they train in a one particular year? Where is the budget allocation for that? You see, these are the things that we should be looking into. If we can look into these things, then everything that we are talking about for the last one hour, Kong Iban, I'm I guarantee, okay, everything will all just fall in place. Everything will just fall in place. This is not me saying this, but if you look at development studies in the developing world, em. Eh? This is how things work. They invest on areas which are critical. If you invest there, everything falls in place. Just to conclude, no. give me just one minute. Hadin ka thma ba ka ba ar Second World War. Day Germany the Germany was defeated. Mo gan si example Germany na mga day Germany football fan, right? Ta Germany was defeated. We all knew the condition of Germany after Second World War. Henry surprisingly. and you can include japan in this mo well, henry surprisingly germany was very quick to come back on its feet including japan you know what is the answer to that they invested both countries in particular germany they invested in that particular sector which was very important to them what was that sector automobile sector then you have the audis and the mercedes benz and all these big vehicles coming from germany Right? You invest in that area where you actually need to invest. Everything will fall in place. I'm not saying history is saying that. Thank you. I believe, uh, like you said, when I love being a top teacher, you see. The kapor la ya, the kani ka jing kliyeng kliyeng iba roy mo. Nita pag di festivals is very much part. Um, and parcel of the entire uh, tourism sector the and when we talk about cultural uh, festivals ngi iba ka monolith festival ka 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 bajulong hapo mo plang ngam te menta ka long la arsin de la long ka monolith arsin and they are trying to do it for the third time third time Mentah. yes but tang ba ka the third time ki jong ki ru kim la mam bania rai te ka jingkeli ka mi ba kini ki bigi bigi festivals mo kom pi ong mane commercial festivals kila ki ki donya ka bor bakin penlong ikata henry habangi pe ekum kini cultural festival lat ngok ka to ka try hill ken 
Bali ke Shimpor ya ka to be specific hang ni ya ka KHDC ban penlong ya ka monolith festival kum ka annual festival jadi kata ka festival ke bajulong man usnem eh ading sha kata ka jing keli belem la ada ban keli dari budanu MDC museum because i cannot answer for them uh, i think the 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 answer to that is um don pisa ma kawai ke ka fun hi haba kut hi ke jing kerdu pisa ke bom dan pisa Aku mengawang mana ka ka state ka jongi ki district council ka jongi we all dependent on the high and mighty laka don shadelhi ne laka long nong 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 ta ban yok pisa ti hajing sisha kum ka monlet festival mo ka ban pen i ka culture ka jongi ngar ngaso ya habi ka ibo ong i i dr benjamin si tourism ku mengawang ba kam kam dei ka a day or two or three days affairs tourism is a year long affairs or Kadai ka kam ka ba ka ba ka ba peteng kam dai ba kut na tang shi si ar si ka ban yo anong tang ya ki tu ki ba don ban ta ma kum ba long ki festival kum ka jala ngi ha ban don ki ta ki ki policy ki ba long <hesitation> you know ki ba long in a long term kum no ban bel ya ka himan resource ki chong ngi kum no ban a yo ki infrastructure ki chong ngi ka lang ba ki bri ki nuan ri ki ki don pat ki festival kum ka shat shat suk men siem ka chong ngi ka wang ka la ka shat nong krem even monolith also Aso bang idei ban 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 encourage baki de ban long man laus nem ya ki bre ki bashong ka shuki le se apo ke chi disi ki ban thawe ki lat ki lenti kum no ban pelong and ladaki even manager ki even company ki lat ban pelong ki festival dan ki event ki ba fair fair lembah ka jing wat sponsorship ka jong ki lembah ki corporate houses ki badan bat kum ta te te ngat rai ki ni ki festival ki jong ngi ki lat ban le kum jo hi Ti hoi ngam la ban juba am la jongki bali kim la ban plong ma la us nem ri ngasu ban kan tu pat la da ki don ki ba sngap ki mdc ki em ki jongi ba ki di ban tau ki la ki lenti na mar ba mon let festival kan dai ka wei ni ki festival ka ba ngasu ba ngi ka usp ka jongi lait na ka lait na ka agriculture ka ba isai ong ka di ka ka culture ka jongi ka ba ngi la ban ka usp ka jongi ban ban pao sha ba so festival like Shat sok men siem kau monolith festival kadai ki usp ka bangi ngi la ban khot ki ki brio bekin wan ban pet ya kane culture ka jongi and second thing ya pro ban promote ya ke eco tourism this natural beauty ka bangi ngi don kum ka chala fi ngim dai ban chu song shit tang ha ki ki ba kum kini ki festival ki ba shi singi ar singi ya ka ba ki brio kin wan kin chu shondur shoot blocks bam jing bam pen jebo ai ki jaka ki jongi kane ka nganget ba kane ka Cherry blossom kod ban long mental ada kin wan ki pat ba ada ki po po hajar ngam tip ke ke ban jai ki surok ke jongi ngam tip ke ban jai ke ki ki jaka ke fair ke fair ke jongi ti ngang so ba we have to promote ya kata ka USP la ni ka unique selling point ke jongi kum ka culture but kum juru kan ni ka natural beauty ke bangi don kum ke chala thank you about roy ka por la ya ti mentang ka kwa ban Kepat lada don manu manu no pedeng jong pi ki audience ki bakwa ban keli jeng keli ki la ban pi la ban rai ki tina ni pi la ban yeng ban keli anyone anyone students da yes hello <coughs> Tak kerja cuma di luar saya marbo. Tak kena cing keli cing amo. Menu menu balap mencuba. Nado menengah yuk semua baik kerana sepanjang tahun sentio tahu dieng ceri belas semua. Ngi senang cingi tak omel ding liang. Tak upu paham tak senang cingi rodan hey we are telling you. Nabo entah apa. Tak kerja keli cing amo ni kelang bang. Ngal alun sekeli luar ni mo. Kam tama ya ka. Nak keli ngasor karma bagi pelut ini ka. Kendai keluar ngi yuk semua tahun meluma. Kendai keluar. Nam tak kene ka. Ceri belas sem. Tengah syukain kai, te kenai kulo ki pelu apa ceri blossom, te ki bawan siman ta ki long kumbak ki on kenai po cari, kenai po, ki expect teng expectation, the one nak kuan mo, kenai po cari, kemudian ki yuan atau kenai po cari, ki poy hadu kalatam ya ka, kenai kulo, te katu ka pisa ke batam nak katu ke bagi pelu, ki bagi ke investment mo, ke profit bagi yuan, te katu ke profit kenai channel pan, kita dekat cikli cunga, kenai channel. Nomor bangar orang di studio dan hampir kiri kata kali channel muka dari mana kacung mud kiri kapi sak bumi nang ni kiri mana channel kiri mana show artis ne kiri mana show pelatinga jangka sorkar ne kiri mana show tingka kemana band sponsor nam tak kini kiri festival kiri kiri dulu ne kiri kenyarap kiri kiri pergi festival jangka nikah celah sih kiri badan kiri babuan 
nek ci le ci pendung ka ke ni ke kelur tangki pelatih ka cung simet ne ngimtep ya kata tak ada nga ai ke ni ke cikli ke ba ngaku ab mentep chano ke ni ke pisahkan le lakin le chano chano mo tak kata hi nga tare de doni ba ba job ni la ju ba be tak cikli jong pi nga ke kata ga di ke ju ke cikli ba i ba roi mane i i bu ke nga ke ni ke pisah ke mi la kan le ci ke pelatih ka juki ni ki nong rai ni ki artist ni ki ni entrepreneurs Lani kan le ko male i ba RG men shop ko autumn fest ba kan pelut ha kamo lenong. Dia mo ko iban dia tang ban shop pun kot kain. Kan ni kalau kencing ai jingmut ya ka sorkan nang ni Ahmad. Lana fi kwa ban pelong ye ki commercial festival. Cherry blossom is a commercial festival that is that came from the word of the person who organized this festival. Wong da ka ba shai ba ka dai commercial festival which means he expect to get something from this festival. So lada ki kwa ban pelong ye ke ba kum kini ki commercial festival. Lada ka sorkar kumbu ong duwe ni kisam laba lada ngi kwa ba kum kajal laban yo nong nong kini festival ka sorkar ka haban un ob ka fi kumba ka long mentang im shai ka cherry blossom festival ka dega festival jo ka sorkar na ka dega jong riu shimet ka sorkar ka aya ka pisang itep nri uba penya ba lek lut na dong shadong pa dega riu shimet ta ka mut lada yo nong yo nong riu shimet nri jing du nong pa dega jing du nong jong a ba jong fi kinong shong shong jo ka jalan na mar ngi hak ban siu ka pisa ka ba ngatit ya ka um Katak sekarang jangan akan lihat hang tu ke arkru tengka. Di katak kajeng aja mood ikut sorkar kalau pun pelada fikwa pun pelongi commercial festival. Fikwa pun yo nong pendon kami ke event manager bakit idon. Aika kontrak ibakit pun penyak siu dah kepisa. Kenapa kajeng yo kau yo nang tu kan wan cek sorkar. Bat kata kepisa kau bangi yo ngilak pun pendon kami kau pasna surong ngilak pun pendon kami kau bete ke hospital. Belap ya kehiman resource jongi kau bangi doktor Benjamin kenapa pun kiu kau jelah. Tenre lada kum kini festival ni kelong nitip ti kenapa begini dari commercial festival kiban penyok nong yanur yanur tenre haka bekut pak kejelah kami AI ngah respect iba akit iba ong ba aijing ken yang ketuk GST kau bayi ong menemo iba akit pi ong banwat arti a ngatip ti kenapa lada wat arti a dengan omio nama kerja dek private it's a private event haduk mentah kami dek festival jong sorkar sor ka sorkar jong jela ka jong i ka ai a portion of money ban yarap nam ta wikin le festival hendre it's not a fully sponsored government program so we cannot ask for any you know ka 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 jing yo jing tip ba kit ong ha ai pelut ba kum no pelut ka arkron ngi la ban ban tip ha ai pelut hendre ka pelut nang ta ka nyu krur ko ba ki a jing ken ban lut kan dai krur la ne ba kin yo ar fo la ne lai fo krur ngi nom yo ai ka jing ken la no no so ka jing ai jung mut ya ka sorkar ko long la da kwa un plong festival commercial festival ban yo nong pelong you know And get some event management company. Yes, but kid. Banjubap, mana mana banjubap ni saya keren lah. Ia ke jengkeli jong di samlam tan berkeren. Di ngatrai ni saya keren hebat di Dr Benjamin. Kat kum ke jengyo i jong i na ki lat petai kubor. Kamdai peranek kamdai kelur, kadai ar kelur. Mau kata kapla syai. Di banpoi pada sya ke ik bayi bah Roy Yong kadai. Ka arti ay ngatray ladang iwat ru inyo ay tangi ka tukar klori. Ti si mentah berperkat ka biang ladang iwat ay katang ar klor na marka taka di pisah jong pajba. Ka tukar bay ka di pisah jong kibay kibay kiri shimet mo. Ti henray hakabay day hi ba piong bade ban ay siya ka event company. Ti tong tong man siya siya ay uni Pet jangan ni agak iru, dia event company ni muru. Tiada ngasih mengaru, ngada event. Kajeng mud kalung kum ni ada bagi. M kalung kum ni, fi ka government kahapan own up kan. Larang ngah invest ke pisah, let government invest nine crore. Nala dia tu, mereka boleh nong nang tu, pat kan long nok jangan government kan. Kalung nok jangan upai bah kan. Larang fi osh four crore, nara four crore, netang si crore. Kan long ngah menta. Lada ng lada government na kacery blossom ka invest ar kruor lada yo nong utu event manager si fu kruor kam day tayo kapisa jong government kata ka jing mud ka jong a kan iba kit ka iba kit ila ben namar ka investment ka one na ka sorkar kumun para lada ka don kono kono p nga 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 perkat ni we are on the same page ka shulong ba lada ka don kono ka kano ka jing pan jing kli ni muta nagaliang ka sorkar ro kan bah ban yisha ilang Bahkan don ke accountability system in place kan, kenang bah kan dia kepisah, kau mukul dia sama mana, kan naik je, but hak nukur kau mungkin yang selok lang, mo, tiada lada kum kata akan rung hak polisi ru, ngatrai ngamtip kan don dengan mana nomor ni syukur kan, don, nomor ni syukur kan mi, mi akan syukur kum ni, lada kam don berdaya hak hak polisi.
Uh, as far as I know, uh, Cherry Blossom is a government is a government festival because there was a tender called for for the festival, and this is this is not the first time Cherry Blossoms happened. I think ba Aldous Maulong was the person who created this festival when he was in the forest department. So it is a it is a government festival. It is not it is not is not got anything to do. event managers. We all were supposed to tender for this festival, and that's how that's how this thing has happened. Coming to coming to funding, you know. Uh, what, what, uh, coming to corporate funding, considering where we live, is really difficult to get corporate funding the way a city or anything, uh, a, 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 like an event person in a city would get. So this is also where the government can actually step in and help us out. Because this, there are 101 corporate companies doing business in our, in, in our state. So if the government were to just step forward and tell, okay, we're having, these are the festivals we're having throughout the year, we would like you to f sponsor this festival, this festival, this festival. I think that's a good way to good way to go about it, you know, rather than it coming from the government coffer all the time. And we cannot, frankly speaking, I can go to Bombay and speak to uh, to co the corporate sponsor. I've done it. I've gone I've gone there, and they will uh, give you this big talk, and they will say, "Okay, I'm giving you one lakh," which and you can't possibly do that. Whereas if it comes from the government, then they have a very good bargaining. They have a very good bargaining power, and you can probably get like properly funded festivals because all over the country. Uh, like I said, like I said, festivals are sponsored by corporate. Most of them, like 50%, sponsored by a by the by a corporate sector, and 50% comes in through ticket sales. We are not able to tap this corporate uh, this corporate thing because we are staying we are away from a really small small state in the middle of nowhere. But if the government were to step up and say, tell all the people that are doing business in our state, like Star Cement, for example, I'll give you Star Cement. I mean, what they what are they doing to the Giant Hills? They're just wrecking this place up. And they spend their they spend their money their their money on sponsoring stuff in Guwahati and in Calcutta. And when we go to them and ask them for sponsorship, they will offer us one lakh, two lakh, three, which is they know you can't do anything with that kind of money. But I think this is where uh, maybe the government needs to step in and just help help out with regards to event managers being able to do large scale events. You know. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Bakit. Piko uh, Aben. Okay. Uh, why? We are concerned with this amount of two crores, and uh, I'm very thankful to our friend here who raised the question. It's a very important question. Kadega jinkli kaba bro ki nongsong nong kiti ban kli. Kwe kalo namar pa kadega jala kaba dok takadao ipisa iba tangar kororo kala matters a lot. Kuring ilipya sa Japan mo kdiat. Bakit ilipya sa Japan mo kdiat? Pi ke ke ceri blossom ha Jepun ke di ke festival. Di sini ru dia ngumi umjuhi. Di sini ru ngilai festival mo. Kajinya pair kalong ba. Pi ke ke GDP kan ni tangka general knowledge mo. Ke GDP jongka jongka setiap jongi kadei lah jar kerur something. Ke GDP jongka India kadei nriu lah jar billion. Tam, kau tahu? Lebih dari plus billion. Ke GDP jom ke Jepun, kerana hendri wajar tam trillion. Tips untuk tu, bagi organis maki ke ceri blossom, ar wajar kerur, lani ar ar kerur tiga mud nak culong. Siapa tu kai ke? Hendri yang ni, ar kerur tiga mud lal, lal halong si sentex, halong kaxiar situ lah. Nah tak ada aku kalung ke concern. It is a concern for us because it has been spent from the public resources. So this is a very important question. I must thank the the person who asked it. And ngingim don jubab mo nomor ba i i honourable mo MDC beri penuan ikhlan wan tenderai ngah ju orang tangan ni kau bayi. Ba festivals should not be a economic driven uh lane kam kam dei ban kam dei ban yalam ka festival ya ka economy jungi lada ka dei tourism ho oi hmm nama ka tourism ka dei borosis nem but not festivals tang kata thank you thank you bhavan uh nga tra ka tu ka jing ka jing ka lai ya jing don chu ka por ti nga ko ko do ka ni ka jing ya there jing mo jungi mata singi but uh ngimla ngimla ban len Ban ong ba ki tamasala ni kerensa ni lekmen ki dekiway na ki benta jong ka kam jong ka perthai ka pala ban kentiu ka yoko kot 
jongki jongka jelahi berkawinlah dangi pendan kamlan yang peloi ki akar kom ke badai ka bai iba i doktor benjamin menei ong kata ka sustainable tourism ni sustainable festival tourism the but uh, we can also agree that festivals are a major attraction and the best way to explore a state a nation or a country and also to connect people to build network to uh, foster relationship between uh, different communities like what bakit had earlier mentioned the ngangek bakani ka jinga the jing mo jing mo ta sngi ka la ban ai jing shai la da om ka ba shai pala run re i believe that it is thrown some light on the issue on the topic concerned and uh, i want to request uh, our viewers on youtube uh, if you have any questions or any uh, statement or suggestions you can leave your comments in the comment section below once again i thank all of you and our esteemed panelists for uh, sparing your valuable time to be here with us and for sharing your insightful the ngipipa ga jing smo si ru ya i ba i mdc jing i mla un wan ngam ta sing im te pale hening a trai ka don ka dao te wala ka tarung i ker men ba ke e ka ba ki ki ni ki panlis ki jing i kla ki la pin sngawa ka ni ka por ka la ban sha jing sha ki ka tu ka ni te li ki jing ke li ka ba phi don te sa ji sin ko ban ai ko play ga tourism club jong a sanat ni college ka ba la long ya ka ni ka rin sa ni te jing mot ti tat hadu pengin de shem yang bat phi ha kawai bat kapor khblei kapor jong phi baro thank you